we're back and we are sitting bougie i'm back at you with another video and today today baby if you watch my buying you know today i'm doing an abido cream review so you guys know i get a lot of questions about abido cream skincare blah blah blah, blah. and as i talk i'm going to be dropping some pictures just to show you how abido helped me personally remember to like comment and subscribe to my channel don't come for me my hair isn't done i literally just chucked it up just came home from uni in a rush like my nails ain't done it's okay it's okay i'm gonna start by talking about abido cream and then i'm gonna show you how i apply it after i take off my makeup this is my abido cream if anyone can tell you about abido cream it would be me i started using this cream when i was in year nine i am now in second year of uni okay <laughs> So, um, I, as a child growing up, I had really, really bad eczema. It started getting worse, like, over, you know, when I turned 10, 11, 12. I think that's when my eczema got a lot worse. I used to have it on my arms, the back of my legs, um, my neck especially. Like, my neck is really, really clear now, but I used to have really, really, really bad eczema on my neck so bad like all the way down going all the way around it was nearly reaching into my scalp guys you you don't know like i literally tried everything like the thing that the doctors gave me if you have eczema you know the thing that they give you to put in your bath to cream i tried e45 i used to drink cerise which is a jamaican herb i used to bath in cerise i used to get out of the bath and and wipe down in cerise listen cerise is a bitter herb so that's what i used to try and use it helped a lot but then one day my friend came to me and said Renice try some of this and then I tried it and it changed my life this cream yeah guys is strong so you only need like just a little pinch and then I'm gonna show you guys how I apply it now because it works a lot better for me um so I, this cleared all of my eczema I used to have it on my face around my mouth um obviously you can't see because I've got makeup but I used to have it on my face, around my mouth. I started to get it on my cheeks. I used to have it everywhere, all over my body. So this Abido cream cleared it up. So when I fast forward to like last year, before I cleared my skin, if you go watch my video, I'm going to put it up there. Cool. Before I cleared my skin, I'm going to drop some pictures of my acne. I think it was acne. I don't know what that was, but I went through a really bad phase. Like, I was really depressed. I started breaking out. When I say I was so used to having clear skin, even though I used to have, like, eczema, my skin was clear. My skin was totally clear. So, when I started breaking out, I was so confused. Like, I didn't know what to do, where to go. This came very handy for me. So what I did, how it works for acne, I'm going to show you guys how it works for acne. How it works for eczema, I would say get a bath, like obviously I don't know if you, you better be bathing at least twice a day. Do you know what I mean? At least twice a day. So, up, so after your morning wash, you get a little bit and you rub it down. After your evening wash, you go a bit more intense with it. So what my mum used to do is when I used to get out of the bath, my mum used to get the cream, just rub me down for a good 20 minutes, just rub, like rub it, rub it into the skin until it's gone, till the skin is dry. Because this isn't here to moisturise your skin, it's got herbs and medicines in it that is there to clear your skin. So if the cream, when you apply it, your skin is greasy, you haven't used it properly, you need to rub it into the skin. Um, the only con I can say about this cream the only con I can say about this cream is that it's a bit hard to rub in it takes ages it does take a long long time and it's very greasy like it's very greasy so it's really hard to like get rid of the grease and proper like rub it into the skin but other than that I can't think of anything on the ingredients it says shea butter petroleum jelly sulfur blended with special herbs extracted from a local plant found in ghana so literally like there's like four main ingredients in this cream whereas your normal cream will have like 20 artificial ingredients so i, I can't find any cons about this cream other than it is very greasy and 
and it is very expensive it is expensive i don't know how much you lot pay for your avido but i pay 10 pounds 10 pounds it used to let me see 10 to 15 pounds it depends where you buy it but where i buy it from is 10 pounds if you're paying like eight pounds six pounds you're not buying the real albedo cream this is the same cream that when my mom went to ghana she saw it in ghana you have to be careful because they sell a lot of fakes you know like the the hair shops that try to sell don't buy no albedo cream from no hair shop are you all right i go to auntie's shop go to auntie's shop you know where she she's selling all the all the like African stuff like go there and buy your Abido cream you lot probably thinking Peckham but this this is where I always buy my Abido cream I try to buy it elsewhere listen you can tell it's fake because it doesn't work this one from Peckham message me and I'll give you the direction this is the packaging of this cream so if the print is too small or like the label is a bit it's not real another way to spot a fake is that it's small this tub of Abido cream is not a small tub. It looks quite small, but if you can see, oh, I wish I could, like, you guys should, could feel the size, but it's not a small tub. The other Abido creams are noticeably smaller or noticeably, noticeably bigger. <laughs> but let me show you guys how I use this cream. So as you can see, my skin is like soaking wet. From using Abido for so many years, I've realized that it works best on wet skin. So before my skin dries, I'm just gonna put it on my skin wet. That's all I use for the whole face. Literally, you saw how much I had on my middle finger. I'm just gonna spread that out. My skin is still soaking wet. So I'm just gonna wait for my skin to dry. And as my skin dries, the Abido will dry with it. And then when it's dry, I can rub it in. Remember what I said about it being greasy? applying it onto wet skin allows it to like your skin to absorb it along with the water remember the water doesn't run off your face it goes into your skin so it allows it to, um your skin to absorb a little bit of the cream as well so when you rub it in it's already like in your pores so you can just like rub and and get it in easy okay you get it So I think it's dry enough now. So I take both my hands. Actually, I usually use one now. I feel like it's not easy for me to navigate around my face. So I'm just gonna rub it in. So guys, I've been rubbing it for a good three minutes. Three minutes. And look at my hand. My fingers, everywhere's still greasy. My face is still greasy. This is what I meant when it takes ages. So you have to have a lot of patience to really rub it into your skin. When you're rubbing this cream in, you want to use the tips of your fingers to navigate the cream into the small creases, such as under your eye, above your eye, around your nose, around your lips. Then you want to use your palms to really rub it into those cheeks. So I'm just going to continue rubbing and I'll be back when my skin is totally dry <laughs> so basically guys i have rubbed in the cream and it's in my skin now and i'm very happy for that so back to the cream i would recommend it for most ages i don't think it's harmful to children like if you have babies i know a lot of babies have eczema a lot of little girls especially have eczema you can use it on them just like for a child i would suggest about this much and then just rub it on the area with the eczema now this is just a disclaimer for my girls with acne when i broke out abida did not clear my acne i had to start eating properly um cleaning my skin properly just changing my like simple lifestyle stuff but what the abido did do was clear the acne scars so that is what abido does it clears your scars and I think with acne, it really does settle it down from like spreading all over. But don't see it as like a remedy and a cure to acne because some girls' acne is hormonal. Like, I don't know, if me, I get spots when it's nearly my time of the month. So, Abido cannot stop my hormones producing spots on my skin. But don't use this as a cure. This is something that will clear your skin. This is what it does. It really does clear your skin. It will clear your eczema 
for sure but acne is not a cure it will literally just calm it down and get away all the black spots there's no like disclaimers or anything or warnings on the bottle because like i said it is relatively safe just don't eat it swallow it don't put it in your mouth like it's for external use only that's the only kind of warning it comes with and there is an expiration date on it so don't use any expired cream cosmetics makeup nothing okay like it is it's, i know you broke my finger and that includes that we don't don't think it's going to be stronger because some people think that things are stronger when it's expired no it does lighten the skin and i don't know if that's just because it takes away like the black spots which can just lighten your complexion but for me i kind of noticed that my skin kind of lightened but then again i feel like my skin has just lightened in general and i'm a bit lighter than i used to be maybe i don't know <laughs> but i do think it kind of lightens the skin and people will say oh ren um your skin looks a bit lighter like you bleaching <laughs> so definitely guys like i do recommend it um definitely invest in it if you have any sort of blemishes like eczema eczema especially i'm talking to my eczema girl my girls with eczema use this it will change your life this changed my life like if i didn't get this i don't know where i would be today my life will never be the same when i say my eczema was so bad guys i'm gonna try and find a, a picture of my eczema so you can see my face and see how bad my eczema was like around my lips and everything look now so literally guys use this cream abido cream available at the auntie's shops okay no hair shops no online just auntie shop because you can be sure that you're getting the real deal um so guys thank you for coming to my channel thank you for watching this video my other skincare routines will be right here click on them so you can see like more about like my skin journey i hope you guys really enjoyed this video like i said it's around 10 pounds for abido cream it's a really good investment one bottle lasts around i don't know eight weeks eight to ten weeks if you really stretch it you don't need to use a lot so it, it lasts me like two months i buy my abido every two months so it is a really good investment like it's not cash loss guys use it use it use it use it like comment and subscribe to my channel subscribe 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 thank you for all the support i've been getting i know i'm new to this like i haven't really been uploading but i'm back and yeah thank you guys for watching my channel and i'll see you guys in my next video bye